You sent the email uh, and when I saw it, I rang Alex, I said, that is exactly what I want to do. There's some bit of fun, there's exercise, which is my whole life. Yeah, at the moment, exercise is um, really important to me and it also fitted in perfectly with my 50th, going there as a, you know, to, to bring it all together. And I dragged her with me. Well, we'd sort of no. planned something for Tracy for her 50th, Debbie and myself. Debbie was also on the retreat. And it, there was a lot of, you know, behind Tracy's back. And when she told me that, I was then on the phone for the next two days and speaking to Damien um, about taking Tracy and going together and, you know, looking forward to a great trip. So it was a really good time. I really wanted to travel and experience Bali and I also wanted to see if I could handle the training in that kind of climate and also the amount of training so uh, they were the two main reasons and I also just wanted to kick start my training into summer and push myself. Well I can tell you one thing all the way up until we went, Alex kept calling it KX Retreat Boot Camp. <laughs> and I said, please stop calling it Boot Camp because it's not a boot camp, it's a fitness retreat. We got exercise, it lived up to... It was, it was, it was good. Amazing. We, we experienced so many other things just than training. It was also good to see other people that don't know Damien for their first training session with Damien and then the next one. And every time it was different and one girl asked me, what do you reckon he'll do tomorrow? I said, I have no idea, and I never do. So I said, just go with the flow, he'll look after us, it's okay. So it was great, surfing in between, high ropes. It was fun, it was lots of fun, and lots of different age groups together. And it was inspirational to see what they learnt from you, and going in there not knowing what to expect, and coming out going, are you opening a, a studio in Melbourne? Are you opening one in Perth? Because it was, they were so inspired by the different and for them to say I learnt more in that first 10 minute discussion about running and warming up than I have ever. I, I'd say it was a life changing holiday, it was amazing because of the location and what I found most, what affected me most was actually being in a group situation in a different environment and meeting other people that were really interested in pushing their fitness levels and challenging themselves and I got really inspired by the other women on the trip. So that was a huge, yeah, I didn't really expect to feel like that, but also I surprised myself by being able to handle most of the sessions because uh, I thought even, especially the running and those sort of things, I didn't know whether I'd be able to, to do them, but I, I managed to do all the sessions bar one in the week and, and do them to a pretty good level, I think. Well, I went to Europe 18 months ago. I did a lot of walking, I didn't do any exercise. Um, I certainly did a lot of things and it was a completely different trip. I gained weight, I couldn't get back into it, I struggled. I didn't experience those. I could have run. I could have run around things and found things to do. So it was really good. You did it. It was fun. You met new people. And in between, you're doing lots of different things. Yes, people told us we were mad. But it was so good. It was so exciting. And it was just a joy to be with the people. And to come back here and have withdrawal symptoms of having, not having two training sessions a day. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Because a holiday to me, the definition is switching off from my everyday routine and my life. So I didn't cook, I didn't wash, I didn't do housework uh, and I felt really relaxed because I was training in the morning and I felt fantastic. So then when I was reading a book by the pool, I didn't feel like a big sloth. So I think it's an ideal holiday actually. You know, not one that you do four, five times a year, but once a year I think it's a great kickstart.
experience. And I think that's part of the importance of holidays, is experience, experiencing different things with different people. It was all organised, we didn't have to worry about anything, people were looking after us, all we did was train, have fun, do activities, and have beautiful meals put in front of us. So I highly recommend it. And every, everyone went there on an equal keel, so whether you knew them or you didn't know them, everyone was e e equal. Everyone started the same and everyone, you know, Everyone improved and everyone challenged themselves and everyone supported one another and we didn't know each other. The team event on the last day was brilliant because that was actually the climax. It brought, it brought everyone together, working together. Well, I have described it to others and I've said it's a fantastic active holiday. So it's a holiday that you come back and you don't feel like you need a detox because you're eating really well but you're also getting to go out to dinners and have a glass of wine now and then but you are training hard so training a couple of times a day and I just explain it to them as a fantastic mix of activity, challenging yourself, being active, hanging out with cool people but also seeing a different culture as well.